Hey guys, in today's video, I'll be reviewing the Krypton OS version 7 for our Galaxy S5. And it has new status bar icons. As you can see, the asset battery has been added. New icons are being replaced with the like uh, in the quick selling panel also. And this is a small update patch over the version 5. So, version 5 is important. So, let's start with the installation and review. <laughs> Before starting with the installation of the version 7, make sure you are on the version 5 and you need to just uh, install the update path. So just power off your device like this. Now boot it into TWRP recovery mode by pressing the volume of the home and the power key. Now inside the TWRP, go to install and choose the Krypton OS version 7 update. Reboot to installation. Now it's done, just reboot the system and it will boot into Krypton OS version 7. So let it boot, I will just set it up and just give you the review of it. And it rebooted really quickly and as you can see no extra changes made to the version 7. The version 7 is much more stable now. All older bugs which were uh, coming are fixed now. Camera has some bugs, but we can see a new theme is applied and it looks really cool see all the icons and also some of the apps also themed you can see into the phone and you can see the menu and all the changes some icon changes so it are some minor changes also if we can notice the S8 battery icon and the status bar icons are from the S8 Galaxy S8 so it looks really much more awesome we also have the edge panels with the blur menu also we get the drawer it looks really awesome also we have the power menu and which looks real blur so it looks really great. We also do have the advanced reboot options so as you can see directly uh, power off, restart recovery and download mode from itself uh, so without pressing the restart mode and then go actually we have the 4 or 5 way reboot menu and it's really handy and easy. So as you can see the settings layout also has been themed the icons uh, look much more better now and minimal and it looks really simple and natural now guys talking about the camera it's the same nothing has changed you can see fast motion is uh, doesn't work see if i record it uh, works but at the first moment it was not working so i was like okay it doesn't work but now it works so it's okay you can see some uh, some of the things won't work because photoshopping i don't know what is that so it doesn't work and if you error uh, have any error just uh, a reboot device or just clear the camera data it will fix it very soon so in the advanced features of the settings you get this block here to applicate well but uh, it's just the app lock uh, so i will just quickly set this up as i need to enter a pin or password so you can use it as i have applied the lock on uh, app lock on the video and as you can see if i enter the video just ask for enter pin to unlock and you will get it unlocked so really handy feature working on this arm it's really great really awesome it's, uh... and guys here ends my review on the krypton os version 7 it's really awesome it's really cool and you can see we have a lot more functions uh, available in this rom so i think this is a real deal and i have already shown you the installation guys so let's proceed towards the installation do install it and really awesome rom it is so you can give it a try the download link will be available in the description for the version 7 patch and also if you want to install the version 5 i have given the uh, version 5 in the i button so you can just watch it and then proceed to the version 7 as that's it for the video for the krypton os version 7 and i will see you guys in the next video till then if you like this video press the like button if dislike then dislike and other things you know what to do just subscribe and goodbye bye bye